welcome to the set of Fantasy Football, baby. Hey guys, it's Marseille Martin here, and we are going behind the scenes of my brand new movie, Fantasy Football. Check it out. The movie is uh, about a young girl. It's Callie, right? Yeah, that's actually my name. Her and her family, the Coleman's, they move around a lot, mainly because of her dad's career path. Coleman, right up the bat, fumbles it. They finally have settled in Atlanta. It would be nice to finally call a city home for once. Fingers crossed that they can sustain in that new city. While her dad is kind of adjusting to this new team, Callie is going through the ups and downs of her new school. All Callie wants to do is be a kid and make friends. Hey. Hi. Young hotshot, running back, star of the team. Then we have Bobby Coleman, who's kind of polar opposite of that. He can't quite find a rhythm with a team. You know, at your age, it's not even about finishing first. It's about finishing it off. <laughs> they discover this magical Madden game. She can control her professional playing football father. What if I played as you in Madden? Bobby Coleman is having quite the day. The most touchdowns ever scored in a single game. With her hiding the secret. How did you pull that off? It's, it's a lot. It's a lot for a 16-year-old girl. Were you just in the closet? No. Let's run this one. All right, here we go. Shout out to the NFL and EA Sports for just for them to open their doors to this amazing space, the Mercedes-Benz Stadium. It feels amazing to be back in Atlanta with the Southern hospitality and the love. I love the space that it provides for me and my family. It feels it's home. You guys know I'm from Atlanta, which is so surreal. It's really amazing being out here, feeling all this energy. This has been like the best set period to, to be at. To have to come here every day does not feel like work at all. Oh, yeah! yeah, the training process was fun. You know, I, I play sports, so I already had a knack for it. There are certain guys in the league who, who are my size or, you know, my height. And I, and I just kind of looked at what they did and looked at their, their footwork and, and tried to mimic that before I got here. In, in real life, my parents are both big football uh, supporters. My dad loves the Raiders. My mom loves the Broncos, and we love the Saints, and we love the Falcons, and, and like all the above. It's We just love the NFL. The football world is my world, and so it, it's helped tremendously just knowing locker room, knowing camaraderie. It's very easy for me to talk to these kind of guys. That's how we play. Great job today. Welcome to my wonderland. So right now we are on set, but today we're shooting at Anderson Fisher's mansion, which is super important to the film. This is where we see Bobby Coleman and Anderson Fisher kind of face off a little bit early on in the movie. You are my favorite player. Yeah. yeah no doubt, man. I mean, we all loved you. The whole fifth grade. So we got all of these luxury cars out here. Let's go take a look inside. This is super dope. This one was from the first day of filming at Mercedes-Benz Stadium. They took these and made them really big. And again, everything about Anderson Fisher is bigger and larger than life. You see that banner up there? Oh, yeah. It's a big me. But I want to show y'all something else. I think it's really cool. Got my own bobbleheads. I'm taking all of these home. Behold, the home theater. <laughs> this scene that we just shot today was basically Kelly Coleman. Woo! playing Madden. How'd you get this good? Ooh, I think the real question is, how'd you get so bad? Ooh. Bobby Coleman calls Anderson Fisher out, and we end up playing. I beat him real bad. The whole dynamic between Anderson and Bobby is really pronounced in this scene, as far as how competitive they are. I give him a copy of the Madden game, which is super important, because from here, that's where the magic happens. He gave me a copy of his Madden game. And he signed it. It's just a game. No, it's more than a game. Stop. I think first and foremost, this movie is about a family journey. Family, uh, love, uh, the dynamic of uh, the relationship between a father and a daughter is really just incredible. What made me want to be a part of fantasy football um, is definitely the father-daughter aspect of it all. When I was your age, I used to go outside. <laughs> Family is everything. I think universally, no matter what language you speak or where you're from, everybody can identify <laughs> with that. Which I think is interesting with this movie is if no matter what language they put it in, people will still feel what they need to feel. You know, they'll feel the warmth of seeing the, the father and daughter relationship. It's a coming of age story. It's so original. Like you do not see a father-daughter film in this aspect where it's such a male-dominated industry. You definitely do not see, especially a young girl, knowing all the technicalities of it and 
helping her dad and being his biggest supporter. I couldn't do it without them. <laughs> he really couldn't. <laughs> <laughs> Thank y'all so much for stopping by. I cannot wait until y'all see the movie.